Hello again my friends, so the Vex Invasion and the new Garden of Salvation raid are now live and there's a lot, and I mean a lot, of Vex to take out, they're effing everywhere. But that's okay, I think we've gotten pretty good at killing them at this point. In fact, the raid has now been beaten, world's first completion goes to Clan Ascend, congrats guys, you were up against some serious competition. Now the raid completion has unlocked a new exotic quest for all players to take part in, a quest for the exotic trace rifle Divinity, and in this video, I'm gonna tell you how to get it. Okay then, you're gonna wanna start here in Sorrows Harbour and follow this raid roots. Now when you get here, you'll have to take out a whole heap of Vex until the Zetian Redemptive Mind emerges. You'll know when you see him, he's massive. Now when you take him out, he'll drop an exotic engram and you'll need to collect this to kick off the quest for Divinity. The next step involves locating three Vex constructs on Nessus. They can all be found hidden away in Lost Sectors. The first Lost Sector is the Orrery. Once you're in this Lost Sector, follow this route. Now when you get here, you'll need to analyse this Vex core, but be prepared because this will alert the Vex to your presence and some of them will spawn right next to you. Once you take them out, you can go back and safely analyse the Vex core. You then need to do this exact same thing at two other Nessus Lost Sectors. Now as you'll see here, the Vex construct will turn back to its normal white colour and this means you'll be able to analyse it and continue on with your quest. Now the next Lost Sector is the Conflux and here's the routes you'll need to take. Next up we have the Ancient Haunt Lost Sector and again here's the route you'll need to take. Now the next step is pretty easy, simply boot up Vex Invasion and kill 120 Vex. You see each Vex drops something called a Decryption Core Fragment and well you need 120 of them. This took me about 5 minutes. For the next step you'll need to purchase an Empowered Decryption Core from the Lectern of Enchantment. It costs 30 Phantasmal Fragments and yeah that's it, that's all you have to do. Now for the final stage you'll need to access the secret hidden room within the Garden of Salvation Raid. You'll find it right after you teleport through the portal so just follow this route. Now once you're here, you'll need to present your power decryption core which will spawn in some steps behind you so that you can climb back out into the raid. And then, well, you'll need to complete a raid related objective. At this time, no player has yet discovered what to do but it's only a matter of time. Once we find out, I'll let you know in the description box of this video so feel free to check back. Like I said, this is bound to be discovered very soon and you can get yourself ready by completing the steps in this video. Now Divinity also has an exotic ornament which you can see here. It turns the weapon an ice white colour. The unique perks for this weapon are called Judgment and Penance 
opponents. The Judgment perk means that sustained damage with this weapon envelops the target in a field that weakens and disrupts them. The Penance perk means that enemies under the effects of Judgment long enough are struck with a burst of damage. So yeah, this weapon is all about sustained damage. Keep that beam locked onto your enemies to take full advantage of these perks. So yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to check back for the updated last step of this quest. Now, I have heaps more content coming your way, so feel free to subscribe and turn on notifications. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll speak again very soon.